Scientific rescue operation has been playing out off the coast of Zanzibar in East Africa after a ferry sunk. Local fishing boats, local tourism boats have been scrambling to try and rescue the nearly 700 people believed to be on the ferry. Local authorities say that remarkably more than 500 people, many children included, have been plucked safely from the ocean, but that many others have died. Bodies are now reportedly piling up on the beaches as people also flock to try and come find missing relatives or family members or friends. There is concern that some of the bodies, though, will never be found because the ferry has now sunk deep into the ocean. Authorities also tell CNN that the ferry was apparently overloaded with rice, sugar and wheat, carrying double the amount of cargo than it should have been. Now, Zanzibar was the destination from which the ferry started. It was going to Pemba, a neighboring island in this poor archipelago, an uh, archipelago that is known by many here in Africa as a, a, a holiday spot. Its white sandy beaches are attractive to tourists. It's also known as an area which produces spices, in particular cloves. But for today, the rescue operation continues and deep concern, of course, by many in that area that the death toll will continue to rise. Robin Kerno, CNN, Johannesburg, South Africa.